Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Fire Red, the randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last part, we made it through Map Moon, made it over here to Cerulean City, beat Blue, and in this episode, we are going to be taking on several trainers with a bunch of random Pokemon, and hopefully they do not have any legendaries, because we may get destroyed. Yeah, that's something we just have to watch out for. Um, all these dudes having a bunch of crazy wild random Pokemon um, that can seriously kick our butts. So we just got to watch out for that. This guy looks like he has um, some water types. So yes, may want to watch his back. And yep, it's starting. Let's go over to Trips. I think he could do a nice job. So what else we got? Meryl, okay. The water types seem... Ooh, here's a Suicune. All right, we got to watch out for that. But it's dead. All right, not too bad. Um, so basically, water type seems to be a weakness of ours. Um, once Sparky learns an electric type move, that'll be much better. And also, uh, I don't know what I was going to say. Let's go into second trainer number here. Second trainer. <laughs> second trainer number. No. Second trainer. That's number. T you, j just stop. Stop trying to make fun of me. I know you guys are laughing at me right now, but you don't have to. I'm laughing at myself, and ooh, it's another water dude, I just realized. Or, water chick. Yep, I guess we're getting ready for Misty. Uh, number three won't be so easy, that's a lie. You're gonna be very easy. Stop lying to me, youngster. You did my- <laughs> I did my best, I have no regrets. Oh, little kid thinks he's good at Pokemon. No, you're not, I'm good at Pokemon. And we got another water type up here. Oh, almost a voice crack, but I think I saved myself. Um, this guy seems to be part um, psychic type, so really those fighting type moves won't be doing too much. And number five on the Nugget Bridge is right here. In oh, shoot. We gotta face this Groudon. I think, I don't think it'll be too hard. We got Big Blue, but he does have Drought, so we just gotta watch out for that. And Scary Face, okay. It's, it's very low level, so it's not going to have too good of a moveset. Mudshot is doing a heck of a lot of damage. Um, there's an Ancient Power, and we did it. Okay, we took down the Almighty Groudon. All right, so we did it. Let's just make our way back to the Pokemon Center. And it even has the PC letters on it just to tell us that it's Pokemon Center, so thank you. Heal your Pokemon in the Pokemon Center. That is very nice of the Pokemon Center to just... Heal my Pokemon for free. Very cool of them. Because if I didn't have a Pokemon Center, I would be probably using potions or something. I, I don't know. Um, so finally, time for the guy that gives us the nugget. Because we are so fabulous that we deserve a fabulous prize. And I actually do want to join Team Rocket. Please? C can, I? can I? Can I join Team Rocket, man? No? Okay. Alright, so you got a Trico. No problemo. And a Meganium, a bigger no problem. Oh, that reminds me of Local from Blaze Black the Egglock. Oh, man. Good old Local. Our last Pokemon went to survive, actually. Um, I know, I would be an awesome Team Rocket dude. I would be like, I would take Giovanni down and become like the head Rocket of Team Rocket. And, oh, what did we get? Was that Secret Power? Uh, no, it's Seismic Toss. Ooh, that's interesting. Um, another fighting type TM. Alright, so we can actually catch a Pokemon down here. And, oh, let's do the Mew glitch, guys. Oh, man. If you guys don't know the Mew glitch, you could, like... In the first generation, if you were, like, talk to that guy, you gotta, like, press the star. Ooh, we got Spark! Yes, Spark for Sparky. We did it. I probably should've got rid of Charge, but oh well. Um, let's try our newly learned Spark. And, oh, man, that was awesome. Even though Arm Thrust did, like, heck of a lot of damage. Um, what was I saying before? The Mew Glitch, yes. Um, yeah, you just have to, like, press the start button before you, like, battle that dude. And then, like, you have to, like, go to another place and a Mew pops up. And, you know, it, it's the Mew Glitch. If you guys don't know the Mew Glitch, go go look at Mew Glitch. It, it's a glitch. Um, we'll heal up Sparky just because he's getting a little low. And time for a Pokemon for, I think this is Route 24. I don't know why it goes up, like, so much for the numbers of this route. But... Oh man, a guard of war. Yes, I want this. I want this badly, actually. Um, oh, you have trace. That's a nice ability. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I should use against it. Um, 
We have 11 Pokeballs, so let's just try throwing a ball. We're just basically really high leveled, so we really can't do much against it. But since it's a fully evolved Pokemon, it is not going to be... Mm, it's not going to be uh, being caught very easily. So... I say we go into... Hmm, this is going to be tough. Woods, I don't think Sonic Boob would actually kill it. So let's shift over to Sparky. Yeah, I don't think Sonic Boom would actually kill it because it only does 20 HP. And it probably has more than that. So let's go for the Sonic Boom. Okay, we missed. That's okay. Sonic Boom, please don't kill it. Yes, okay, it didn't kill it. Great, 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 great. Very good, Sparky. You are doing a great job. Alright, so now we just have to chuck a bunch of balls. Oh, that's so close. Alright. No! 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 Oh, man. Urgh, that sucks. Ah, oh, that would have been awesome to have. I love Gardevoir. Ah, oh, that really sucks. Hmm. <clears throat> well, we got another chance in this route right here, Route 25. So, we can catch another Pokemon. But first, we gotta get this item right here. It's Petri Berry. Okay. So Route 25, what's going to be our Pokemon here? I try to forget about that last capture, or failed capture. Ooh, it's a, it's a Primeape. That's nice. Um, we'll go for the bite on this thing. And another bite. Alright, so hopefully this is easy to catch. Primeape looks like he's a little angry. You can see by that little, little indent on his forehead. I don't even know what to call it. But we caught Primeape. That's awesome. Um, but we also have to think of a nickname, and that's always the that's always the tough part. Um, so we'll call you. Oh, I know a perfect name. You'll be. Oh no, not Mrs. Miss. Wait, got gotta press that select button. Always have trouble finding that select button. Miss Piggy because you're, you're a pig it's the pig Pokemon you don't believe me it's somewhere in the Pokédex I don't feel like going to but uh, we got Primeape not a bad moveset not too bad it's like having a Mankey but a fully evolved Mankey this early in the game um, and oops and you know something about these hikers you really don't have to worry about um, having rock types so yes can actually do some work against them because I was just about to like switch out yes, and I was like, wait a second. They might have grass types, which he actually did. So that's that's nice for yes. Um, we gotta eventually get that firestone in um Celadon, so maybe a little while till we get an Arcanine, but you know. Just gotta keep fighting through it. Hopefully our Growlithe does an awesome job. And another dude here, and ooh, you actually do have a part rock type, so that's very cool of you, but too bad you had to die. Sorry, Wayne. Alright, um, time to switch out again, just because we want to have everyone have equal levels, and I'm not going to use Miss Piggy because we already have a fighting type in Trips that can do some awesome damage to those auxiliaries, so Trips is a pretty cool guy, and we just have so many trainers that we want to battle, that we have to battle, and Mega Kick, oh man, that does so much, um, Let's switch out to Sparky. I don't know why I didn't do this in the first place. But Spark that Gyarados and Spark the Seal. Spark them all. Um, we want to heal up our little Bally. Ball of Fun. Oh, that's what we should have called him. Ball, little Ball of Fun. Because he's a ball, he's little, and he's fun. So Triple Kick is not doing too much. Oh yeah, I forgot he's a flying type. Um, so let's switch out to Sparky. Because Sparky can take care of these flying types. And hopefully it's flying type Pokemon. Yes, it is. Okay. I was hoping it wasn't... Uh, grass types because I wanted Sparky to do some damage and Sparky's using his spark and something that you always want to do is make sure this guy goes down to fight you you don't want to go up to fight him because then he opens up the trigger to um, get that pokeball and the pokeball is usually secret power which is actually a pretty good early game TM because it's like the 70 base power but I want to get every single TM in this game because this one is metal sound yeah, not too exciting. If you don't um, make this guy go down, you could always come back here with Cut and get Secret Power, but 
You always want to do that just just to get like the earlier the better, basically. Um, not to run. I wanted to heal up because you know I don't feel comfortable with trips being low in HP, but. Whoa! Trips just broke out of power fusion, and oh man, I was thinking we were actually going to see that sometimes, like having two of the same Pokemon, which he did. He had two lanterns, so we'll never know if he was a water trainer or an electric type trainer. Oh man, the world will never know. Um, so let's switch out yes to the front and battle this young lass that has bug types or poison types. I don't know, and it seems to be poison. So let's just bite you. I don't know why I'm biting over Embering, but. You never know. Uh, switch out to Big Blue. And Big Blue can do his Big Blue bubbles. Not bubbles. He has Water Gun now. But, ooh, we want to heal that poison because we're badly poisoned. Alright. And yeah, also in this generation, as you walk, you get poison, which doesn't happen in 5th and 6th gen. Or I don't even think 4th anymore. I think 4th they stopped doing that. So we gotta talk to Bill over here. He's a true blue Pokemaniac. And he likes to, uh dress up in his spare time as a Clefairy and do some crazy things with himself. So th this is this is Bill's life. Bill is a uh, he's a strange guy. Very very strange. Oh, okay. So here's Bill. He he changed out of his costume and he was doing a magic trick. He was going from one portal to the other. Can I, can I do that? I, I'm I'm a magician. No, I, I guess I can't go in there. Come on, Bill, let me go into your magic box, please. Please, Bill, I, I wanna go into your magic box, but we got the SS ticket. It doesn't matter anymore. Magic means nothing when we could hop along board of the SS Anne. Cause the SS Anne is so fun. It's a party. You get to ride around in a boat. You actually never get to ride around in a boat. That is actually the worst part of it. You never you get in, you get to be in this huge cruise ship, but you never get to ride around in it. I actually felt like I really wanted to get that this berry right here. It was an orange berry, so I knew I knew this berry was meant to be mine. So let's make our way back to the gym. And we can just speed up. We, we don't need to waste our time. Alright, so we don't know what type Misty is, I just realized. So I was about to put up Sparky in front, but gotta remember the randomizer. Uh, let's put over uh, Miss Piggy into the PC. So move our Pokemon. Oh man, we have a stacked box. That Charmeleon man. I'm, I'm sad we can't use CC. Oh well. Um, it's time to face the gym leader. But that'll be in the next episode because I mean like that. So the next episode we'll be battling Misty and her gym grunts trainer things. So thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.